Hey my Zatima fans, I hope everyone is doing amazing. Uh, the video you guys are actually looking at right now is the new intro for the Tyler Bryce win of Zatima. It's finally released guys. Um, the preview was on BT last night and the first two episodes are now on BT+. Trust me, it's giving everything it is supposed to give. You guys have to check it out. Check it out on BET Plus. It's amazing. So I'm going to do my review of episode one. And we're going to talk about what we're expecting going forward. And I'm going to rate, rate the show to tell you guys what I think about it. And I mean, they recorded season two and now I understand why. So before I dive into all the review and the breakdown, go ahead guys and subscribe. Hit that post notification bell like share and definitely leave a comment to tell me what you think and if you have watched the show which part of it you loved the most so we're gonna dive right into the episode the episode starts off with them in fatima's apartment um it's gonna be her old apartment and she's boxing everything up putting everything in storage and they're basically talking about starting the new chapter there's a team chapter that they're about to start together um fatima says she's not gonna sell her place she's actually going to rent it zach was like are you doubting that it's going to work and fatima was like no it better work because you're gonna have 99 problems and fatima is gonna be all of them and that was pretty funny i mean guys if you watch the episode it's so good so that's where the episode started off and then it moved to her meeting up with her girls which is angela and belinda so she's meeting up with her girls and she's telling them about how she met zach and the girls they're eager to meet her and fatima was like can you believe i actually hit him with my car and the girls were like yeah you can't drive <laughs> fatima all this gangster and cannot drive she's not a good driver so they're just making a joke of it that that's the reason why she hit him with the car um angela also announced that she has a new boyfriend but she had to step out of her race he's not black and uh, she had to step out of her race to get what she wants and belinda was like it must be the d fatima that's why you're so in love <laughs> and everybody knows that's the contribution to it so they're there talking and they want to do dinner the following night at Fatima's and Zach's house, right? So Fatima gets home and she's telling Zach all about her night. Um, Zach was actually at a basketball game before that. And that game scene, that's actually one of my favorite scenes from this entire episode. So they're at the game, we have Bryce, Nathan, and Tony, right? And they're asking Zach, like, where have you been? And Bryce is like, he has a girlfriend, he's in love. <laughs> Zach did not want to announce all that because those two, they do not believe in the whole settling down, getting married and all of that stuff. So that scene was pretty funny. We actually met Lori in that scene as well, Nathan's wife. Because at the point where Nathan was like, marriage can be a headache. And then Lori walked up right behind him. And she was like, she was aggressive. She was just demanding him where to go, what to do and all that stuff. So that was pretty funny. I love that scene. That was actually one of my favorite scenes from the entire episode because it was funny. And I like the vibes that Nathan and Tony brings to the show. I like it. The next scene we see is when Fatima gets home and she's sitting there telling Zach all about what happened with her girls. Because the girls are eager to meet Zach. And Zach is explaining that the boys want to meet her as well. So they decide on having dinner for the next day. And Fatima wants to paint. She wants to put a little, you know, she wants to add her little taste to the place. That doesn't have a problem. And then from there, um, apparently that made her a promise. Oh my God, guys. When I tell you, the next scene took me out. <laughs> because there was like a little break where we see like what's happening in Atlanta. And then it went to this. <laughs> Listen, I can't even show you guys what happened there. You guys have to go and watch it on BT Plus. But let me tell you, that scene nearly took me out because that scene, I didn't expect it. It was so explicit. You see, you see what's happening there? Zach licking his fingers. It was so 
explicit it was so um it was rated pg-40 <laughs> but i mean it was good their acting was on point as i can't say i didn't expect to see this i expected to see a lot more of it but it, it took me by surprise because it was so sudden like i didn't expect it that fast but after they're there explaining and um fatima is saying oh so you're really in love because you want me to lay with you after normally guys just want to be like oh i'm going to sleep or i'm hot or whatever but he wanted to lay there so he's like she's like so you're really in love and zach's like you're saying it like that i keep telling you that but she's looking at it different because he's really just completely gone for him um so it's the next morning and Fatima is ready to go to work. Zach is outside wiping down his car and she's looking for her car. Zach bought Fatima a brand new car, a drop top convertible. That's her dream car. So we see that their relationship is not just about sex. Their relationship is actually about them listening to one another, what their likes and dislikes. So she was so excited about that car. <laughs> She was extremely excited about the car and I'm happy for them. I'm happy that he's able to do that gesture for her, even though it really doesn't matter to Fatima if he could or could not. But it was really nice to see that she was so appreciative of the gift that he gave her. So he's there dancing, celebrating that he's the man and then Bryce shows up. Bryce is there to tell him that the SEC is going to call him. Um, they're probably gonna wanna come to his house or come to the office. And Bryce is suggesting that, oh, I can prep you for the questions and, you know, letting him know that he's ready, he got this. Because the SEC is coming to visit him. It's, um, Fatima leaves work. She leaves work and the next stop is the pole. Now, the pole is a strip club that Heather works. That's the baby mother, Zach's baby mother. And she's there talking to Heather. She wants to get her to come to the house to get a DNA test done. But Heather is, Heather is not interested. Heather is saying that she wants her child support check first. And have to, after she gets her child support check, then she can definitely do a DNA test, which makes absolutely no sense. So Fatima was like, oh, so you're a street bitch. Fatima grabbed the girl head and banged it against the wall. <laughs> and told her she better be at the house by 6 o'clock. So I'm guessing Heather is going to be at the house at 6 o'clock tomorrow. The scene then switches to they're at home. Um, Fatima is preparing for dinner with her friends. She is nervous as hell. And they're having a conversation. Zach is telling her that the SEC called and they want to talk tomorrow at 12. And she is just... Um, she is just too nervous about the dinner. She wants to make a good first impression. But she they, they talked it through. And she told him that, hey, no matter what, I'm going to be here with you. We're going to get through this together. You know, just reassuring him like she always does. So dinner has started. And Angela and Bryce shows up first. Funny thing, Zach didn't know that Bryce was Angela's boyfriend. And they were actually friends from a long time, right? So it's like, oh, we know each other already. I know Fatima knows Bryce and then Zach knows Bryce so that's cool they're there they have a drink and guess who shows up Belinda Belinda is the girl that Zach so Belinda comes in and Belinda is like hell no Fatima really this is the nigga that you've been bragging about <laughs> it was kind of funny because she is just in utter shock to say oh my god like really this is who my friend is with this this man is, is he's a nobody he just sleeps around right so um they come in and fatima asked her how do you know him and she was like mm, they they had sex right and that was actually the end of the episode belinda belinda is funny she's one of those friends that's loud and crazy and speaks what's on her mind but I think maybe she has true intentions, right? But she it was just in shock. And Angela was just trying to calm the whole situation down between them to say, oh, that's what happened. So Belinda stepped with that before, but it was way before Fatima. And that was basically the episode. I'm telling you guys, the episode was only 30 minutes, but it was packed with so much that you really don't complain about it just being 30 minutes. It's enjoyable. It's funny. 
um, it's giving everything that it's supposed to be given. Like Zatima really didn't disappoint. It was good. You guys really have to get it and watch it. It's it's good. I mean, the glow up for both of them. Fatima looks so good. Zach looks so good. They all look so good. The camera quality is amazing. The sex scenes will catch you by surprise. But I mean, the episode is good for it. Be just being 30 minutes, it was pretty good. I would give it a full 10 out of 10. I can't wait to see more. I wish they dropped all 10 episodes, but I understand why they wouldn't want to drop all 10 at once. They want to give that build up to go back to season 5 of Sisters and that's completely understandable. I'm looking forward to so much more. I have so many more videos because I have so many questions, so many things I want to answer based on what happened in these first two episodes. So go ahead, tell me what you think guys, leave a comment, tell me your thoughts if you have actually watched the episode, tell me what, you th what your thoughts on my review don't forget to like share and subscribe if you haven't watched the team you guys need to go and watch it on BET plus hey guys thank you so much for watching that video if you enjoyed it go ahead and subscribe to our channel like share leave a comment and check out all the other videos on our channel thank you guys so much for watching see you next time